Okay, no bolt cutters here. Oh, there they are. Well, that was that was kind of pointless. <laughs> All right, September 7th. I have no idea why September 7th. The last game I played by these guys, Amika Games, the last game was called Father's Day. I guess they have a thing for days, <laughs> holidays, days of the week, calendar days. I'm gonna turn up the gamma just a, just a tad because these games get pretty dark. Emotionally, mentally, but also graphically. Is that a music box playing or is that coming over uh, like a loudspeaker? I see an eyeball sitting there. I see the Crypt Keeper over here. Wait, I thought I chose the English version. It says play with me. I, I definitely chose English, right? I guess, okay, so I guess what, that's what they do. They, whatever language you pick is what they'll interpret it to. But I guess Amika Games is probably a, maybe a Russian company. If that's even Russian, maybe I'm wrong. The, the cool thing about this company is you can always expect a, a quality horror game. Like they have a pretty good track record. And this is it. This is the whole game. Yeah, we're not allowed to leave. I'm going to take this. Did we win? It was a music box, by the way. There's a little music box playing next to the Crypt Keeper. Ah, uh, yes. Dima, 19 o'clock. It's a good, it's a good time. It's the, uh, it's... It's a little, is that a monkey? It's, it's a little doll from the memes. I don't know what these are actually from though. The meme featuring these guys always reminds me of like Mr. Rogers or, or some kind of like show from like the eighties, but I don't know where they were actually from. I'll have to look that up. Does anybody know? Like where, where did this meme originate? What's the show? Before we go in there, let me just look around this playground real quick. See if there's any evil clowns lurking around. We can't jump. Oh wait, we can actually go on here. And they actually work? Dude, I was not exp I mean, deep down, I hope that the seesaw see and sold, but I wasn't expecting it to work. Dude, good for them. I gotta give them bonus points. Is there anything else? Are there swings we can get on? I'm gonna go up the slide. I'm breaking all the rules now. Oh, I fell off. We can't climb the ladder. So the only way to go up the slide is to go up the wrong way. Hold E to slide. <laughs> it kind of looked like I was. I was just zooming in. For a second, I was like, are we actually sliding? Uh, yes, beer bottles in the sandbox. So many childhood memories. Can we click on these? Can I take these? All right, let's go check out here. Oh, dude, I... Was there a, an English version to download? It, did I download the wrong one? Because this would be even more scary if I knew what this said. You know, like what I'm thinking is it says, uh, do not enter dead inside or do not open dead inside. But for all I know, this could be like, enjoy our game. Have a good weekend. You know, check the tasks. Anya said she left me a surprise near the door. Is that... Is that the surprise? Which door? Oh, dude. What, what was that? Oh, it's a bird. Oh! I, I saw the bird move and I'm like, oh, it's just a bird. There's a woman out there. Oh, great. Here we go. Already starting. Yeah, I have no idea what door they're talking about. She's still out there. I can't. I can't see. Oh, there's a kitty here. Hey, kitty. It's the it's the sequel to Stray. Uh, oh, oh, there we go. Here we go. Here we go. This is probably the surprise. Anya and Dima, Dima, Dima. I'm gonna say Dima, but it's probably wrong. All right, we can't go upstairs. Imagine if this was real life. You're like, all right, let's go upstairs. Oh, ah, oh, no, blocked by the tricycle. There's no way we could possibly get around this. Ooh, next time. Next time, kitty. Here we go. We got the we got the surprise. Let's see what's in here. Oh, come on, just open it. Oh a loading screen?
Wait, where are we? Are we back in that starting room? Check the tasks. Okay. Turn on the lights. And the oh, we're inside the apartment. Dude, I thought it like kicked us all the way back to that starting room with the Crypt Keeper. Turn on the lights. Oh, oh my God. I forgot I had a lighter. Like I can't see anything. It'd be nice if we had a flashlight or even a lighter. Oh. We have been living here for three weeks. Oh. What was that? I turned on the lights and then someone blew out the candle. But it wasn't me. I was all the way over here. Okay, we got the lights on. Check the gift. I hope it's something good. It's the, uh, it's, <laughs> it's the elf from the loading screen. It's like a, the green goblin. Oh my God. That's a thumbnail right there. Shitty gift, return it. Hey, it's the thought that counts. All right. Thank you. What an ugly doll. Where did she get it? Go to your room. Why can't it just like, okay, look. I try not to be too critical of indie horror games because I know it's not these big studios that work on this stuff. And I actually am a fan of Amika Games. But like, why can't you just like put it at the top of the screen? Like, hey, do this next. Or don't tell us at all. I don't have to keep hitting the, the tab button to find out my next task. Oh, okay. So many little knickknacks. Can you imagine sweeping up your entire apartment like that? Dude, my back would be sore. Oh, we can go in here? Okay. Wait, wait, hold on. I gotta test out the piano. Can we actually play it? No. Gotta take points off. Unplayable piano. I still wanna know who that woman was outside. I'll sort out my backpack. Uh, it's been three weeks since I've been studying at a new school. Something, something, something. Read faster, Swole. Read faster. The internet is not working well again. Warning, possible epileptic seizures associated with increased sensitivity to light. Wait, wait, wait. That, that was at the beginning of this game. You guys didn't see it because it was loading in. I think that was a streamer playing this game. Or maybe another one of their games. I guess that's sorting out the backpack, just dumping shit all over your desk. Check the books on the table. Yeah, they look good. Yeah. Check and check. Check the books on the table. The only... Uh, Dima, I am so glad that you and I study at the same school and live next to each other. We had a great summer and I didn't want to part so much. Call me today at 2200. That's 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock. Uh, Dad will leave the house at this time and I can talk. Mom usually leaves notes on the fridge. And he, come on, give me, give me like two seconds to read. Something about mom leaving notes on the fridge. Okay, so that's it. Not, not check the books. Check the notes on the desk. View the list of tasks on the refrigerator. All right. To the refrigerator. Footsteps. Must inspect. I can't tell where that was coming from. It sounded like it was coming from in here. Is there anything out here? No. Uh, let's go check the front door. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Ah, uh, hey. Hey, little fella. I see you've come to life. <laughs> oh! Check the tasks. I don't take my eyes off him. Oh, yeah, yeah, the refrigerator. I, okay. Why is the game called September 7th? It's not even the 7th, it's the 29th. They just put like random words in a in a hat and they just like, uh, seven, uh, September. 
September 7th. Sounds like a good name. Let's do it. Because even Father's Day, it wasn't much to do with Father's Day. Oh, dude. Now I'm like super paranoid about the little doll. Is he still out here? Yeah, he is. All right. He's good. Yo, that uh, that elf on a shelf is, is next level. Elf on a shelf. I'm surprised that wasn't my first... My first thought. All right. Here's the note on the fridge. Can you guys read that? <laughs> All right. I'm going to attempt to read Russian. Tell me how I do. All right. I think the first line says, straighten the sofa. I could be wrong. It's been a long time since I've spoken any Russian. I think number two says, wash, wash the dishes. Number three says, clean up the big room. Four is definitely uh, clean up the kitchen. And then five is take out the dog. Nope, no, nope, hold on. Trap, take out the trash. All right, hopefully my, anybody that speaks Russian, you'll have to let me know. Did I, did I do well? Did I read it? Okay, the, the doll's running around. I heard footsteps, little tiny footsteps. And he's gone. Yeah, he's gone. Immaculate pronunciation of Russian. Thank you. Well, I didn't I didn't pronounce any Russian. I just interpreted. I translated Russian. You heard the piano? I heard something. I get, I, get, I heard it like a little jingle or like a, almost like a one one ding of a bell, but I guess that was the piano. Evil elf, are you here? Do you think he has a name? Oh my god. Yeah, there he is. Yeah, he's on the piano. He looks so happy though. Like, how can someone be so evil, yet so happy at the same time? <laughs> I hate turning my back on him. Straighten the sofa and armchair in the living room. Okay, that's good. Oh, that looks good, too. Well, what was that? Was that me? Like, I heard something sliding. Was that me straightening the, the furniture? It wasn't him. It sounded like it was coming from over here. The hell is that? Oh, there's a whole gang of them. Is that an elephant? What is it? It is an elephant. What did you see? I, I hope this one's on my team. Oh, wash the dishes. We're just supposed to act normal with all this going on. Oh, well, at least he put the chair back. That was nice. What the f was that? Well, I turned off the radio, so what, it sounded like someone had a record playing. Oh, are they teaming up? Are they together now? <gasps> <laughs> I, okay, maybe maybe it's the elephant with elf on a shelf, and then maybe there's like a third doll that joined the party, and now they're all standing on each other's shoulders. Maybe it's not as big of a threat as we as we think it is. No, no, because there's the elephant. Okay, so he's not involved in these Scooby Doo shenanigans. I don't see the. I don't see Elf on a shelf. They moved the chair, so now I'm blocked. All right. Brace yourself. Oh my God. Oh, I gotta see what the scratching is first. I think the elephant's gone. All right, we can't go out there. All right, here we go. I am a Russian computer hacker. Something moved over here. Uh, I think that was that reflection. But there is somebody in the hallway. Maybe it's the woman from outside. 
Okay, it's nothing. I apparently I'm seeing things. All right, we're back in the kitchen. Well, one thing's for sure: this little guy's staying put. So, at least I can relax. They're not all out to get me. What is that scratching? <laughs> I thought they would let us get a little closer to whatever's making that noise. I didn't even get through the doorway. And it looks like it knocked me on my ass. Uh, I hit my head. Uh, okay, I just thought of something. If I was a developer and I hit somebody with a jump scare like that, imagine like if, 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 they tur if someone turned around and you had another jump scare like back to back. Because I was like, all right, before I go that way, let me just look and see where the, where the creature went. Because you just got... They just ran you over, so now they should be behind you. Imagine if you turned around and they got you again. Someone needs to do that. No one would see that coming. No one ever does back-to-back -back jump scares. Probably because it's not good for the heart. Probably a lot of heart attacks out there. So evil entities that we have to deal with are some giant zombie-looking thing. Possibly an old woman from outside. An evil elf on a shelf. Now, the elephant, I don't know. I, I can't really say if the elephant is evil or not. He's just kind of there. But then again, so is Evil Elf on a Shelf. He just looks mean. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Well, at least it's not closed. Okay, that's good. Anything in here? I can't shut that. I hate when you can't shut doors behind you. I feel so, I feel so vulnerable. There's your problem right there. Seven years bad luck. Yeah, you should've never broke that mirror. Here we go. Okay, so here's the explanation of why it's September 7th. Tomorrow, September 7th, we are moving. Dima needs to go to school and Uncle Vitya, Vitya's car broke down just before moving. We've been putting off so much time already. Now we need to think about who to ask to help us. I hope that in a few days you will find someone with whom to pick up our things from the old apartment. We'll take the most necessary things with us for now. Call me as soon as you can, or as soon as you read it. So tomorrow is September 7th. That's why it's called September 7th. I would, I would have called it Evil Elf on a Shelf. Dad quickly decided with whom he would transport the boxes. I mean, if they just gave us like maybe, maybe 10 more seconds to read. All right, lights are back on. Clean the living room. I, I have no idea where the little elf went to. It's kind of creeping me out because I feel like he's around, but I don't see him. Like, I, I feel like we're going to like turn around. It's going to be like, you know, up in a corner, like peeking down at us or hiding amongst a bunch of junk. Like what if he was like in line with these guys, just kind of chilling. Take the broom. Oh, that was quick. I wish cleaning was that easy. Shut that. I heard a thumping noise. It didn't sound like a door. It sounded like... It sounded like possible footsteps. I love how they put a rug on the wall. Um, Because it, it does a really good job keeping footprints off the wallpaper. Hey, before you walk on the wall, make sure you take your shoes off. Come on, Charlie. Take your shoes off if you're going to be walking around the walls. Me. Clean up the kitchen. All right. You guys hear that? I can't tell where it's coming from. It, it could be coming from back there. It sounds like maybe in here. It remains to throw, wait, it remains to throw out the garbage, okay? Yeah, loose translations. Still have no idea where the elf is. Oh, and they closed the piano. Oh, no, I closed it. I closed it when we cleaned up. All right, let's take out the trash. Oh, wait, we found the elf. Hey, would you mind, would you mind, you know, taking out the trash? There's a ghost out there and I'm scared. Will you protect me? He's like, I am the one who knocks. Oh, we're gonna throw out the doll too? Now, now I kind of feel bad. I was getting attached to the little guy.
I wish they didn't have loading screens. I think it, I think it just a little bit takes you out of the moment. It's just enough where it's like you're you're in the zone, you're creep, you're opening the door, and then loading screen. It's a constant reminder that you're in a game. Throw the trash in the trash cans. Got it. These guys are still chilling, dude. What if it turns out that these are the real villains? These are the masterminds behind the whole thing. All right, where's the, is this the dumpster over here? I'm a little nervous because there was some woman out here lurking around. Okay, I finally threw away this stupid doll. Yeah, you stupid doll. You're out of here. Be careful what you say. He looks like he's chilling though. I think he likes it. I think he likes lounging in the dumpster. He's all like laid back. You stupid, stupid doll. Come home. Okay, okay. Say no more. Oh, come on. They, mo they moved. They were over here. I'm telling you, I don't trust him. There we go. It's like a, it's a perfect triangle. Like I'm looking at her. She's looking at him. He's looking at me. I'm looking at her. <laughs> I think I found the old woman. I'm assuming it's the same. It's the same thing. I, I was trying to go up the stairs and just avoid this. Wait, let's get out of here. If the game turns you around. You know what? We'll, we'll come back later. The game's like, nope. Oh. oh god dude look at this thing do you think the dolls are coming from this apartment like obviously there's dolls in this apartment but are the ones that keep messing with us is this, is this their origin right here this is where they came from another one of those little monkeys it's creepy fuck what kind of glitches wait what kind of glitches who is this woman <gasps> He's breathing, right? Is that him? Wait, how did he get in? Well, whoa! Dude, he's so fast. Okay, he's no longer there. He's actually in here. And there's a little note. Play with me. <laughs> okay. Okay. What do you want to play? Oh, God. The door's open. I'm curious to know what's behind here. I wonder if we'll ever find out what's going on in there. Okay. So the woman is standing up or possibly levitating. I can't see. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, she's... She's not levitating, but her feet are off the ground. Did he do that? Is that is that his idea of playing? Well, f it, I'm going home. Shut that. All right, we made it home. I wonder what's waiting for us inside. I, I guess I'll get it. Where have you disappeared to? You went into your house three hours ago. My room faces the courtyard. I saw you taking out the trash. I went into the entrance and our neighbor on the first floor had the door open. I decided to, I decided that something had happened and decided to check, but I didn't think that so much time had passed. Which neighbor are you talking about? She died last winter. What? Are you sure it's her? Anya, where did you find that gnome doll and why did you give it to me? Dima, are you all right? I didn't have, I didn't, I didn't have you. I, it's supposed to say I didn't give you. I can't, I can't keep up with the typos and the. Dima, there's someone here. What? Anya, what's going on? What did you see? Need to get out of the house. Something happened to Anya. I don't, there's something behind me. They boxed me in. Well, who's that? Oh, it's, did he get taller? It's the elf on the shelf, but I think he got taller. I don't remember. No, he definitely got taller. 
he's like three feet tall now. He was about, I don't know what, like a foot? Tripled in size. Oh, I thought this was a Christmas tree. Jesus. I was like, how, how nice of them. It's definitely a body wrapped in Christmas wrapping paper with a star jammed through its head. I, I like the nice touch of plugging in the lights. I mean, good, good for them. How many knives did I hide in three drawers in the kitchen? Wait, wait. How many knives did I hide in three drawers in the kitchen? What? How many knives? What's out there? There's something else wrapped in paper. I'm assuming, is that another body? It looks like they're kneeling down. Oh, dude, look, look how, how creepy is that? Oh my God. Oh, that's so fucking creepy. I love it. I love it. Could you imagine? Just spam random numbers and we get it to unlock. So that is a riddle. How many knives did I hide in three drawers in the kitchen? Well, I don't know because I can't open anything. Oh, wait, wait, here we go. That's not a drawer, that's a cupboard. Count to five and go to the left. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> okay what do, you, what do you got here for me little buddy <laughs> find four christmas tree toys when you go through the hatch so three five four how many knives one wait i can't see them all one two three four five six i keep thinking that the end of this one is another knife it's not so one two three four five six so three Six, five, four. I wasn't sure if the six and the five were flipped. Climb through the hatch. And away we go. Oh! God damn it. Oh, shit. he's really quick with the masonry. How did he lay bricks that fast? Dude, these are all box. Is that the same one from the kitchen? Did he move it over here? Or is this another person? This looks like the box that the doll came in, but maybe a little bit bigger. Something's been stabbed with scissors. All right. Oh, oh, it's definitely a horror game, guys. It's officially a horror game. There's bolt cutters in here. But we need a crowbar, also evidence of a horror game. What'd that say? I saw a crowbar at dad's. Find a crowbar. Don't come in here yet. Oh, and then there we go. We need the bolt cutters for the chain. Guess I'll take these bells. You know, you never know. You never know when you're going to need a good set of bells. Dude, I, I hear the, the little elf running around. I hear the elf, but I don't know if he's actually animated. You know, like it's probably just like the sound. I was hoping that we could actually see him moving around, but I don't think they... I don't think they go into that great a detail. All right, a crowbar? Uh, would a screwdriver work? Wait, 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 wait. What's this? I took it away. Search. Search where? I feel like one of these is going to start moving. Like it's not. Uh, there it is. There it is. <laughs> okay. I take back what I said about him not. I, I thought we were just going to, you know, hear the sound of him moving around. But every time we see him, he, he, he would be stationary. No, we just saw him actually run. Oh, 
And they took the bolt cutters. What's this say? Okay, do you need a bolt cutter? I hid it in the closet. Well, why would you tell... Why would you tell me where you hid it? Like, you took the time to hide it, and then you're just like, it's in the closet. Why would you do that? Okay, no bolt cutters here. Oh, there they are. Well, that was, that was kind of pointless. Oh! Dude. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, we found the... Uh... Did it have eyes before? I don't remember it having eyes. All right, we got the bolt cutters. Let me just look around real quick, make sure there's nothing else. God, that's so creepy. Okay, I got to take points off on the lack of animation of the bolt cutters actually removing the chain. They're like, they got the bolt cutters now. Just let them open the door. Don't, don't even bother to animate cutting the chain. Dude. F*** these headphones. It sounded like someone was banging on the wall behind me. Like, not in the game. It, it literally sounded like someone was banging on the wall. Oh, God. <laughs> I I literally said earlier when we came in here, hey, at least the curtain's not closed. And here we are. My worst nightmare in a horror game. I, I feel like when I open it, if there's something there, it's expected. Maybe they're going to, what is it? Subvert our expectations and there's not going to be anything there. Okay, but it, there is water in it now. Okay, we got a Christmas ornament. I guess I'll take that. You good, ma'am? Oh, she's gone. Okay. Can I turn this back on? No, we can't turn the lights on. It's cool that we can flush the toilet. Oh, God damn. I was gonna say it's cool that we can flush the toilet, but there's like no, there's no purpose to it. We can flush the toilet, but we can't play the piano. Come on, guys. Come on, get it together. Wait, am I supposed to leave? Okay, we can go out the front door. Let me just look around real quick. Generally, if they, uh, if they let you leave, they're pretty much done with you. All right, that's still closed off. Okay, let's just get out of here. Okay, they, they're not letting us leave and they're not done with us yet. Every other time we opened this door, it was like a loading screen and then we were outside. I was not expecting this. So now what? Oh, wait, wait, we got that ball. We have the ornament. But where does it go? Oh, uh, here's the tree. No, it doesn't go on the tree. I don't know where this, I don't know where the ball goes. Wait, 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 what was that? I thought we could interact with something. I thought I saw the hand show up. I guess not. Find four New Year toys. Get out of the apartment. Find four New Year toys. What What, what does that mean? Oh, okay. Okay, the, the candy cane. We could... I, I thought I could interact with something. I didn't realize the candy cane could be moved. So we have a candy cane. We have... The ornament. We got those bells earlier. Does that count? I'm guessing there's only one thing left if the bells count. <gasps> Wait, what? Dude, this was all brick. Now it's open. Uh, here's the starting room. Oh, I just realized that the thing I thought was a Crypt Keeper in the beginning of the game was actually the elf. I didn't even, 
I didn't even notice. Game over. Play with me. Yep, yep, I am. Oh, hey, here's the star. Check the task. Decorate the Christmas tree. Not that one, right? The, the actual Christmas tree. All right, let's go back. Brace yourself. What? There he is. All right, so big version of the elf showed up. Wake up. I was sleeping? Oh. He's, he's playing Summer of 58. That's one of their other games. Who? Who gets scared of a video game? Come on, man. I can't move yet. I'm stuck here. Is that it? I mean, I I can appreciate the uh, the barrage of jump scares, but I, I'm gonna say I'm, I'm feeling a little unsatisfied. Yeah, look, he's playing Summer 58. Yeah, I called that. Wait, this whole thing was just an advertisement for that guy's channel? He paid them to make this game just to aver I'm, th that's not the case. I'm just, I'm just being hypothetical. That's it. We never got to the girlfriend. We, we were sleeping the whole time. First of all, that's a huge cop out. I hate movies and games where in the end it's like, oh yeah, it was just all all a dream. And what about the the meme, the meme monkey dolls, meme monkey dolls that were outside? Like nothing came out of that. I mean, dude, if if someone said this was a demo, I'd be like, this is great. This is a great start. I can't wait to see what the rest of the game is like. But that's it. That's the whole game. September seventh. I feel like that name doesn't doesn't really mean anything. I don't know. I mean, maybe maybe evil Christmas or something like just something because clearly there were some Christmas vibes and it's also weird that they release a Christmas game a week after Christmas actually almost two weeks after Christmas I can't believe there's chapters you know how many chapters this game had it had one it had one chapter this game was good it was it was solid until it ended it ended way too soon